Hey guys, this is the Dark Preacher, and welcome back to FTB Horizons 3. So, I did a little prep work off camera. I went to the end, and I killed a whole bunch of shulkers. And I decided I'm going to see what these uh, special shulker boxes are all about. Now, this is just a purple diamond shulker box right here. Just a diamond shulker box. Holds just as much as a diamond chest. But, you can pick it up. Well, you can do that with a normal chest preacher. What's the difference? Uh, well, with this one, I could put, oh, say, a piece of redstone in, and you can see it. Okay. Uh, obsidian one. I'm thinking it's a little more blast proof, but still, same storage as this one. And in this one, we have the stuff that's ready for today. These are compact machine walls. I collected these out of the world because there are compact machines out there that are broken. It's spewing lava everywhere. Missing blocks. But, you can pick it up and put it in your inventory and it doesn't lose its inventory. Now what we're going to do is we're going to take that and that and switch them around. We're going to turn off the coin because we have to throw something and we don't need to be picking it back up. Up here we have four miniaturization field projectors. They have to be one block off the ground in order to do the 3x3 three three crafting. So that way they can easily see what they need to see. And with nine blocks of iron and one piece of redstone, we get half a stack of compact machine walls. So, we put down our shulker box, and put those in there. Now, we're going to take out a stack of these, and we're going to look at uses. We need 98 of these in a 5x5 five five configuration. Well, that means we need to make a much bigger space for this. Because this is fine for making the uh, compact machine walls, but not so much for making the actual compact machines, because those things start out pretty big. Now, silly me, I accidentally made more than what I needed for personal shrinking devices. But I now have some backups. So... Um, I do believe we're going to have to go outside for this. And it's currently nighttime, so we're going to take a little nap. Let's head outside. Find a nice, big, flat area. This will work. Alright, let's see here. Put that away. This is the one with it? Yes, it is. Okay. We'll grab that and that. And we're going to build the thing first and then set the uh, things where we need to set them. Three, four, two, three, one, two, three, four, five, two, two, two. And this needs to be hollow on the inside, so it says three, four, five. And compact machines are a bit of an older mod, but it's been updated, which is a good thing. I always love it when mods get updated and they see like major sweeping changes that 
change the way some things are made or the way some things look but it still has the same core functionality to it like with the this 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 is a whole new way of crafting these used to be you would just craft them in a crafting bench like any other normal everyday item and it barely got used okay so I need let's see here one two three four five I think maybe that's right I don't know we'll find out in a second And that will put me right here, on there, and we should have another one. Oh, well then, that's not right. That doesn't seem right. Huh. Well, obviously I screwed something up. Okay, one, two, three, four, five. Let's see here. One, two, three, maybe here, I think. Yeah, that seems right. One there. One there. And one right here, I'm thinking. Hmm. Nope. Incorrect. One small complaint. <laughs> the, uh, item when dropped in the world is not a small item so let's see here maybe it was one two three four maybe it was two of them eh? maybe possibly no Not there. Okay. Pre building the thing before setting the uh, actual projectors. Not a good idea. Um, give me the arrows back. Okay. One, two, three. And then one, two, three, and then one, two, three. Still saying that's not right. Still saying there's a grass block in the way somewhere. So here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to grab this, move it up one, and then grab this, move it up one. This is my first time actually playing around with this, so I can't remember things from what I've seen in other YouTubers' videos. Uh, let's see how what. That. Oh, that's not right. That's not the correct direction. And that. Hey, there we go. Okay, a little bigger than what I thought, but okay. Uh, let's see. We will grab one Ender Pearl. We will. Cue it in there. 
and away we shrink. The great thing is, this doesn't cost any power. Come on. You're almost done. And boom. One tiny compact machine. Now we can set this guy down. And I'm going to click it with the personal shrinking device. And in we go. One 3x3 three three on the inside. Pocket dimension. And back out we go. And we'll pick this guy up. Now. We're going to need quite a bit more because we're going to build the next size up. Which is... 11 by 11 by 11. Oh, dearie my. That's a large compact machine. It's tiny. There's a large... There's a giant and a maximum compact machine. The great thing is, once you get past the 5x5 five five stage, it just goes 11 by 11 by 11 Which means I need to move these back and up one, I think. Yeah, because this is a 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. That's a seven by seven by seven. So I do believe one, two, put that there just in case. Okay, and put that there and that there. One right there. right there put you right here and then one two three hopefully that's correct uh hmm Oh, pfft. you ended up facing the wrong way. Crazy things. All right. Th mm. Nope. And like that. And no, still not right. What the heck, man? Eh? And try again. What the heck? All right, let's see if we can turn it with a wrench. And yep, yep. Like that, there we go. Alright, and this is Well, it's off the ground by one, but it'll work. Okay, so one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. That's nine by nine. It's not big enough. Oh, rats. Uh, let's see here. Let's put you... That's 10. That's 11. So let's put you against that. And we'll move that there. There we go. Put you against that. Flip you around. And check. Okay. I 
Oh, so it needs to be back one more. Okay. Go away. Go away. Okay, so... Why are you pointing down here? You know what? Try again. Okay, we'll put you on the opposite side of this block. And move the block. That should be right. And then... Ooh. Did I move you too far? Something about that ain't right. Okay. Let's see here. That goes... Right there. The rest of this we can just break down. And then... Go back and over some. So, one, two, three, four. And you. And yeah, that's where you go. Okay. Let's turn it. There we go. That should be right. Let's see here, 369, 65, 369, this way, 369, 69, grass, what, negative 839, What? Does that mean I need to do that? Is that it? No. Negative eight thirty nine. Too far. Too far. That? Or this? Seem I need to go out and cut the grass. Oh, pfft, that one freaking grass block left. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Break that torch. That should be it. So we do an eleven by eleven. With a hollow inside, and toss in an ender pearl, and that will get us a large compact machine. And yes, while it may be large on the inside, it only takes up one block space when it's completely done. Holy cow. This is going to take a lot more of these. Uh, do I have some sort of building thing? Let's see here. I do! I have a diamond wand. That'll work. And that. Oops. Uh, one, two, three, four. There we go. Okay, and then... Four, five, six, seven, eight. And then we just come around here and run out of blocks. Okay. Well, rats. Well, we'll just head inside, make some iron blocks, make some more of those 
Compact machine walls. Won't take long. Do, 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 do. Iron. Craft. Oops, no. Yeah, let's do 18. That shouldn't take very long. 18 of those, a little bit of redstone. And come up here. Like I said, doesn't take very long. You can make a lot of these if you have enough iron. Which quite frankly I do. Okay. Let's go see if we can't finish that out with just a stack. I doubt it, but still. I can try. I can darn well try. Okay. And new. It looks as though I'm going to need at least two more stacks of this, so I'm going to take a moment, make some more of this stuff, and I'll see you guys in just a second. Alright guys, I'm back, and this has got to finish out the episode, so... Away it goes! Wow. Wow. So basically, the reason why I'm building the large compact machine... By the way, it took 90 blocks of iron to finish this thing off. Uh, the reason why I'm building this is I'm going to put bulk storage inside of it and hook it up to my uh, refined storage system. I'm going to put drawers of things that I have multiples of inside this thing and hook it up to the refined storage system. Because inside... Get in there. There we go. Inside is a 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. It's a 9 by 9 by 9 structure on the inside. And it's chunk loaded all the time. So everything that comes into here is going to be chunk loaded and I'm going to fill this thing up with drawers and a drawer controller and I'm going to figure out a way to hook it into my refined storage system hey it is external storage yeah yeah buddy so part of that I'm going to be doing off camera in this episode and next episode. That's it's basically it's just going to be making the drawers, filling the thing, and figuring out what I want to put into bulk storage. Uh, let's see here. Com is it no compact? Compact M for compact machines. Uh, let's see here. Uh, hmm. Com Okay, let's try packed. There we go. Easier to spell. We got redstone tunnels. We've got tunnels. And these handle power and fluid and items. This handles redstone signals. So what I'm going to do off camera is I'm going to test and see how well this thing hooks up to the tunnels. And here is the little structure you make to make the two tunnels that you can put on the inside and outside of these things. So we need eight redstone around a compact machine wall and a hopper on top and we toss in a piece of redstone. So yeah, that's what I'm going to be working on between episodes. But that, what the... Hi, where'd you come from? <laughs> Where did you come from? Where did you come from? 
Oh, you came from over here. That's an easy fix. Where's my torches? There we go. All fixed. Uh, by the way, this is my teleporter to the end, if you couldn't tell. This one goes to the nether. This one goes to my astral sorcery stuff. This one goes to the lost cities. So, yeah. Huh? I hear you. Where you is? Oh, okay. That's where you is. Very well. And I can't place that there. Can I place it there? I can place it there. And I can come over here. Place no one there. There we go. Good to go. So, as always, I'm the Dark Preacher. This is FTB Horizons 3. And I'll see you guys in the next episode. In we go!